for Santa Cruz, inside left channel, works it back onto his right foot, finds Pedersen again, he's looking for half a yard to shoot, he's got no one there, does lay off towards Dunn who cuts back in field on his left foot, tries to kill one, brilliant goal from David Dunn! And Paul Ince's reign as Rovers boss is off to a magnificent start. About 20 yards out, he cut back onto his left foot and has curled the most delightful shot past Tim Howard. Arteta. Oh, terrific free kick from Mikel Arteta. And Everton get the equaliser just before half-time. In by Osman, it's scrappy at the moment. Rukubu looks left, finds Arteta. Better now from Everton. Can he pick someone out with a cross? It's a deep one towards the back post. Yakubu's there, and Yakubu gives Everton the lead. I think everyone's wondering how Rovers are behind in this game, but you just had a feeling that that goal on half time was going to play a really important part in the game. As Warnock goes forward, Santa Cruz has got him behind Lescott, and Santa Cruz equalises. Well, the birthday boy gets Rovers back on level terms. Less than 90 seconds after Everton had got themselves in front and Rovers deservedly are back on level terms it's now Everton 2, Rovers 2 and we have got a fantastic game on the opening day of the new Premier League season a penny for Paul Ince's thoughts right now what he wouldn't give for someone to pop up with a winning goal Warnock will take the free kick, Samba is forward, Santa Cruz forward, Oya in the middle, McCarthy and Nelson are the men to aim for, into it goes towards Nelson with a header off the post Oya wins the game for Rovers and Paul Ince gets his reign as Rovers boss off to a winning start and just look at the joy on the face of the new Blackburn Rovers manager Andre Oya gets his first goal for the club and Blackburn Rovers are victorious on the opening day of the 2008 2009 season and how much will that mean 